armed robbery in progress. 133 Franklin Road at Bank of America. I was a day shift sergeant at the time. Headquarters all units should be a single male suspect armed with a gun. I knew there was a robbery. I knew that it was in progress. Uh, and I knew that the suspect was armed. But I, what I did not know was that the suspect had a rifle. 65 California Tire, two point north on Franklin Road. Stand by for direction. This was after one shortly after 1 o'clock on a Monday afternoon. It was on Franklin Road between Church Street and Old Hickory Boulevard. I said he's got an assault rifle. At the time that I turned left on Franklin Road was about the time that Officer Bellis, uh, now Stephanie Warner, was involved in the shootout with the suspect in the intersection. Six, we got shots fired. But Stephanie got out of the car. The car remained in a drive, so the car actually started rolling without her behind the wheel. And she used the car basically for cover uh, and was backing away into that intersection while the suspect was firing on her. Come on, you. We do know the suspect fell. He got up and he walked into the Walgreens parking lot. 60's on foot, he's got a gun, he's by H.C. Walgreens. I had stopped my car to get out of the car, so my car door was open. I was outside the car with both feet when I saw the suspect. Start get out of there. I really didn't see the man, I saw the gun. AR-15 rifle at 3,000 feet per second. He fires his first round at me, which went through the door. It went through the driver's door, which was open, and it struck me in the left leg, uh, just above my knee. Point three, headquarters, get me there, what's up here right now? We got an officer down. I tried to avoid uh, any more gunshots hitting me, uh, which I used uh, my right arm to drag myself across the front seat of the car. The suspect sh fired several shots uh, at my car. When the shooting stopped, I assumed the suspect was gone, and that was wrong because I looked up over the dash. Again, my head's in the passenger seat. I glance up over the dash, and I start hearing the suspect. He's yelling. Come and get me, come and get me. He's got the gun, he's got it stuck up in the air. When he stood back up from that, uh, the other officers began to fire shots at him. Suspect, one suspect on the ground. I thought that my life was about to be over. <laughs> I had some regrets, as we all would. made a few promises, and I think for the most part, I've kept those. Four people put their lives on the line for me. They really didn't get a lot of attention. Stephanie and I, you know, we won awards and some of the things that uh, people said and did were, you know, were incredible and, and, you know, I wasn't deserving of that. I was trying to do my job and help my co-workers. Tommy Campsey and Steve Walling and Richard Hickey and Jimmy Campbell deserve more credit than they got. There's no better place to work in police work and law enforcement. If you're going to be on the local level, there's no better place than Brentwood, Tennessee. No matter where I'm at, no matter what I'm doing, I'm always going to be a Brentwood officer. <laughs> Sorry.